Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to talk about the section designer in SAP 2000. So uh, before we start, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification button. And if you like this video, please put a thumb up as well. So uh, in SAP 2000, you can go to define section properties and, and uh, frame sections. And uh, next you can click on add new property. And in this window, you can uh, select many type uh, of uh, material like steel, concrete, or aluminum. But uh, we have only the predefined uh, section in uh, each uh, section of the material here. But if you want to create uh, a custom section, uh, you can go to other and uh, you can click on section designer so uh, next you need to select the base uh, material so uh, in the first um, example here I'm going to I'm going to select a steel um, property so uh, now the general steel section uh, design type here is available uh, we can click on here or we can uh, uh, use no check or design here as well uh, we have the property modifier as well so this is the property after you create the uh, section but uh, first you need to uh, create a, a, a section uh, shape so you can click on section designer uh, button now uh, you need to create uh, your section here so I'm going to click on I section so I'm, I'm click on the center here and uh, if you want to uh, change this uh, I section you can right click on this section and you can change here so you can change the material or the uh, location uh, or the uh, the size of uh, or the thickness of the uh, the plate as well. So I'm going to change this uh, unit first, and uh, I will change this to 300, and this is 300 as well. So uh, after you make the change, you can click OK. So we have a new uh, shape here. And uh, next, I will add the uh, uh, C channel uh, section and click here. Next, I will did this. So uh, I'm going to rotate this 270, OK and I want to move this uh, section under the I section here so uh, I will change this 300 and this is uh, 150 so uh, this is too far so uh, I need to move uh, this section closer to this one so I uh, right click and I will change this to 225 so uh, now we have uh, this section and I think I will change this to 100 only and uh, we need to change this to minus 200 so now we have uh, this section I'm going to click done and OK and uh, OK now I will uh, draw the uh, section and so th this is the uh, shape of the section that will I just created so uh, we can use uh, this section in the model and uh, we can find the internal force after you run the sexual analysis 
and uh, the next example I'm going to add uh, uh, a composite uh, member so uh, I will choose the concrete here and we can go to section designer I'm going to add the uh, rectangular uh, section and uh, we can view the uh, property of this section so I will keep it uh, like this but uh, I will add a rebar so uh, we can uh, use this tool and we can right click on the rebar as well to change uh, so this is for the corner uh, rebar and I'm going to change this to 20 and apply to all corners and uh, next we can change the edge uh, rebar so I'm going to choose the same one and apply all edge and uh, next we can change the um, the size of the rectangular of the rebar here so I'm going to change to 400 so now we have uh, this uh, section and uh, you can view the uh, interaction curve here so this is the interaction curve for this section so if you want to uh, design this section you can uh, uh, use the uh, external force that apply on the structure and uh, use the interaction curve here see if these uh, uh, those force are uh, inside the curve or not so uh, this is really a good uh, way to design uh, the uh, custom uh, section so um, I will add another uh, steel section inside uh, this column but uh, I will compare with the uh, inter uh, interaction curve here so I will uh, do the screenshot and uh, we keep this and next I will add the eye section and I will change the side here So now we have a new uh, section we can view the interaction curve again and if you notice the interaction curve here change and uh, you can compare with this one so uh, so you see uh, these are uh, different so again you can use this interaction curve and uh, do the section design uh, with the apply force so uh, now I'm done with this section I will uh, now I will click OK uh, done and OK OK and I will draw the new section so uh, this is the new section here you can run the structural analysis and take the internal force and uh, to design your uh, custom section you can uh, also use the section designer uh, which uh, has the uh, interaction curve here so uh, this is it for this video and I hope you get the idea and uh, Thank you so much uh, for watching. I see you guys in my next video.